among called by this council of elders Kiamagiaduri to give an assurance to the parents who have initiates or to be initiates because they are not initiates <coughs> those boys who are in grade 8 because all traditionally it's been we were, we've been taking our boys at grade 8 for circumcision and I said since his firstborn went through the same process at the same age let this guy not go past that and then he's strong enough so he came for this ceremony for the assurance and be told the do's and the don'ts and what he needed to do people actually don't even know as we speak huh? there are people who are saying that grade 9 will be domiciled in proper high schools not yet decided others are saying we'll continue this current system whereby JSS is in the previous primary schools the same rumors of people not going for the cut were there because people thought that for a cut you need when you're, you only do a cut when you're moving schools, which is not necessarily the case. So my decision is based on he's of age, let him go that route. I think, okay, it's much as it's an individual choice, I want to believe that even in our times when you we were going for the cut, there were those boys who went to f <coughs> for the cut while in Form 1. Maybe they were too young. That is excusable. But you could, exp you could see something like a discrimination whereby 99% of the class have gone, had gone the cut, and that one boy has not gone through. You can tell there is some trauma there. I would suggest that everyone goes for the cut this year. Yes. I strongly really recommend. Tell you about like, the kind of ceremony you are here today. The elders advise the boys on how to relate with their parents, their siblings, and their teachers. So don't expect this boy to grow horns and start behaving like an adult in front of his teacher. He, actually, the teacher will have a better student and a better pupil with him having undergone the cut. I'm going to talk to you I'm going to talk to you today. I'm going to talk to you but at least I'm going to talk to you today. There are some do's and don'ts. Na tumefurahia venye this time ameamua kufanya watoto wetu watairi. It's a privilege kwa wazee na tunashukuru sana. Kuzi wakipito na e age, si dhani ukimpeleka next year itakuwa a little bit challenge kuzi miaka yake itakuwa imepita kidogo. Lakini hatupileki watoto kwa sababu, uh, tunaweza sema ti kwa sababu wamemaliza shule ya manini, but age yake imefika ya kutaili, which is, I think advisable is 13 to 14 years of which I think it's the best time to do, to do that. I mean, I think it's the best time to do that. But for now, when you say that maybe I'm not going to go to that school, I'm not going to go to that school, but I think it's the best thing, even if I'm not going to go to that school, I'm not going to go to that school. It's going to be like a challenge, and I'm going to go to that school. Yeah. What do you mean, Nikimani Jogu? What do you mean, Nikimani Jogu? Chairman Kiamba Sabukaute, Kundi Awaze, Leo to Mekua na Hafura Yawazazi, Semina, Wazazi Wamekunja, Wamekunja Wazazi Wengi, Natumoerezea, Irem Taratara to Nakuaga Nai, Mambo Kutairiza Vijana, Nakuasomesha, Nawazazi Wamekubari. Sasa Koi Wale Vikundi Vile Vikundi Wanasema Watawataris Vijana. Sasa sasa hawa wataka hivo, lakini kundi yetu ya waze, kia makiyama sisi tukotiari kutairiza vijana. Tarajia pande ya kia butu na tarajia kaa vijana miaine. Na pande ya kia mba tena vijana tu kaa hao. Judio, rio dio namba yetu saini sana sana maramingi tunakuwaga na, na, na vijana mia nane. Pande ya miaine na pande ile ya kia mba miaine. Ule ya kutakuwa metairiwa, atakuwa na, atakuwa na adabu yake peke yake. Atachunga, atachunga pande ya vijana, wawa wawaja tairi, atakuwa mtu wa metairi, atakuwa na mambo yake mwenyewe. Kama wazee haduoni hile sababu, inawasafanya watoto wa sitahiri, kwa sababu kama wakikuyu, hadutahiri watoto wetu na na shule, tukisema hadutahiri watoto na shule, tutakuwa tunawakosea sana, kwa sababu hata masobo hadujui, ya wazabadirika tena, ya de grade 10, ya badirika tena ya de grade 11, Siju kama tutakuwa tuna, tuna, tuna badirisha na masomo ama tutakuwa na badirisha na vire tulikuwa na, tumezoea kama wakikuyu. Tunajua kuna kabila wengine wao wanatahiri wakiwa grade 4 na hakuna mtu wana wanawauliza. Hawa wetu 
tunajua tunawa tunawa tuna watahiri wakifika miaka 14 na wakicherewa 15 sasa tunaona watakuwa wamecherewa sana kwa sababu hata sana sana wale wana wanapona haraka na wale tunaona wanastahili kabisa ni wale wako na miaka 13 lakini miaka 13 14 tunaona hao hakuna hakuna haja ya kuwaweka kama sisi wazee tutaongea na wao tutawafundisha kama vile tunafanyaga hata wakadua mwingine tuwaonyeshe vile watakaa sana sana na walimu na watoto wale wengine na wazazi wao tukijua hata ikiwa watakuwa kwa hiyo shule na kuna watoto wengine hawajatahiri hata manyumbani kwao wanakutaka watoto wengine hawajatahiri pia yetu tunasema kama wazee hatuagazi hatu sana na, ma, na mambo ya masomo kwa sababu hata kuna wale wengine wanatahiri hata wakiwa kwa mahospitali wakiwa wadogo na wakija kwa shule tunakaa na wao sasa tunataka tuna tufunze hawa wetu wanatahiri wakiwa na ile miaka ile iko iko sawa na wakienda kwa shule tutawaambia vile watakaa na hawa watoto wengine